Hey, Bob Dylan, leave Monica alone. Don't harm Monica. <laughs> Don't you ever... to a girl, if I can um, imagine her pooping and it turns me on, <laughs> and I don't mean like what she looks like sitting down on the toilet, I mean like what poop actually looks like coming out of a butthole. <laughs> like that's how I know if I'm into a girl, if I can run her through all of the ropes courses to the... <laughs> to the pooping part, which is a high ropes course. <laughs> <laughs> Farting is low ropes. Pooping is high ropes. That's an analogy. <laughs> Are you guys closed casket or open casket? <laughs> when, you, when you go poop, do you to say goodbye? Do you, do you wash it? <laughs> Or do you close it and, and, and make your piece like that? <laughs> what do you guys do? <laughs> I, I cremate mine and then I sprinkle it in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's where we spent most of our time. <laughs> it was on the toilet. <laughs> There's the, the <laughs> being a comedian, similar, another analogy. I hate, I love duality <laughs> about thinking and analogies because it's like, it's good because it's like, oh, new perspective, but ultimately gets old when that's all you do. Um, what was I saying? Oh, it's sort of like similar to being a parent and knowing, having a bunch of kids, like you're a Catholic, and you have a bunch of kids, and you know some of your kids aren't gonna grow up to be shit, and you know some of your kids are gonna grow up to be successful, and that's what it's like having a book of jokes. Because <laughs> I know kind of which ones, but I still wanna talk to the ones in. <laughs> and I know they're gonna be shitty. <laughs> because I don't feel that it's, like if I was gonna nix him, I should have stopped him at the at the um, at the conception of him. <laughs> uh, I should have, I should have never I should have crossed it out and made it not okay to say on stage, but I didn't do that with any of these. <laughs> when you abort a cabbage patch baby, <laughs> it's called making coleslaw. <laughs> 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 Um, good whiskey is better whiskey than well whiskey, but well whiskey is better grammar than good whiskey. <laughs> well whiskey is better grammar than Kelsey grammar. <laughs> Sorry, I have cerebral punzi. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and for those of you who aren't laughing, I hope you have Parkinson's disease. <laughs> Do you think when Michael J. Fox goes to the mall, he has a hard time finding a place to Parkinson's? It's a mean pun. That's a mean pun. <laughs> Angry pun. I hate people with... Parkinson's. <laughs> my, girl, my girlfriend sort of cheated on me with somebody with Parkinson's. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> she, she, she gave him a hand job 
But she's just trying to get his attention. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my she's just God. trying to snap him out of it. <laughs> <laughs> That's horrible. <laughs> I hope nobody in here ever gets Parkinson's. I hope, I hope this is like AIDS only room. <laughs> I hope we all go from AIDS. <laughs> No, I hope our deaths are as diverse as our life paths. <laughs> That's what I wish. I have a lot of things. Six minutes, that's what six minutes feels like with me. <laughs> Was it worth it? <laughs> I mean, is it worth it? <laughs> let's not, let's not, um, <clears throat> Plu, Plu Perfect is future, Plu, is Plu past or future? Plu Perfect, past. Does anybody know? <laughs> we should all know. <laughs> A uh, t-shirt, fur is murder, fur isn't murder, dark fur is murder. That would be the t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys need some genocider to wash that joke down with? <laughs> <laughs> genocider. <laughs> um, I don't like to think of it like the Holocaust. I think it's... You know, it's just a weird thing to think about. I like to think of it like really elaborate pre-production for Schindler's List. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> so what Tony Robbins calls a reframe. He's trying to make, you know, look at something better. I mean, how much did, did Steven Spielberg donate all of his money to Holocaust survivors? I bet not. I bet not. <laughs> Not putting all my money on it, but I bet not. <laughs> Wiping is like chess. The fewer moves you can do it in, the better you are at it. <laughs> Something like that. Poop joke. Poop joke alert. <laughs> I, I want to be able to, if, like, before I do every poop joke, I fart, but I have, like, a, a lav mic connected to my butt, so you can always hear when I fart. <laughs> and you know, you, when you hear fart, there's going to be a poop joke coming soon. <laughs> Does that make sense? <laughs> Does it make sense? Okay, I see it. I see <laughs> your fucking. Uh, I see your HTC. <laughs> I see your big screen TV. <laughs> Phone. Trying to be better than the iPhone, so we're going to make the screen a little bit bigger. It's not going to fit in as many pockets. <laughs> just going to do this. Let me just do this page with it. If a dog breaks a mirror, it's only one year bad luck. <laughs> if a dog breaks a mirror, it's only one year bad luck. <laughs> if you've been in a wheelchair for more than 10 years and haven't written a book, come on. <laughs> oh, what have you been doing? <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> what else are you doing training for a triath that didn't think so? Oh, oh, training for a murder ball? No, you're not. <laughs> I'm totally not murder ball. Murder ball material. <laughs> Whenever I read that word uh, Baptist, I think sometimes I'm reading the word rapist. You know? Just like a quick glance over it. And whenever I'm raping a Baptist, I think to myself, Where's your God now? <laughs> oh, God. So that's a hard one to sell because I have to become a rapist. I have to become like a. Whatever. <laughs> Let's leave him not on a rape joke. Let's leave him on an abortion joke. I like to do 
I like to do abortion jokes before rape jokes usually. No, vice versa. Chronology. Guys didn't like that one. You didn't like that one. You sort of like that one. What do, what do I do? We've already eaten the we've already eaten the appetizer, the meal, and now I'm supposed to impress you with the dessert, whereas you weren't weren't impressed with other things. What do I do as a host in that situation? Thank you all for coming tonight. Um, I really appreciate. Um, uh, I worked really hard on this meal, though I wasn't expecting. <laughs> Just one more good one, Ben. <laughs> Just one more. Uh! 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 <laughs> okay. <clears throat> It's like we were making love, and we got to the point where one of us has to come to terms with we're not going to come. <laughs> Has that ever happened to you? <laughs> this is happening now. <laughs> we're going to stop fucking just so we can preserve our own body parts for the next time that we might actually have some fun. Yeah. <laughs>